everybody and welcome to another exciting installment of Wrestling Rampage. The two amigos are back. That's right, we're back and we're going to continue on with the WWE Retrospective Pay-Per-View from 2007. Tommy, we're almost done, man. Yes, yes, we're almost, we're almost done. done. We got this 2007. one. We got Survivor Series 2007 and we got Armageddon 2007. And then we're done. And then we're done with 2007, guys. So here we go. This is WWE Survivor Series 2007. This is the DVD review for you guys. November 18th, 2007. Raw Smackdown ECW pay-per-view. Sponsored by THQ's WWE uh, Smackdown vs. Raw 2008. Um, the theme song is Tick, Tick, Boom by The Hives. Um, well, this song, when I was hearing this song, this song gave me hives. It did. Uh, you know, uh, I'm not a big fan of this song. Not a big fan of this song, but it's it's definitely not the worst song I've heard. So, no, but it still sucks. Yeah. Uh, but here we go. We're at the American Airlines Arena in Miami, Florida. Miami, Florida. For uh, there was no dark match for yeah for uh, for some reason. But here we go. We get the first match on the card is a triple threat match. For the ECW, and of course, World ECW's Champion. got to be first. <laughs> That's right. For the ECW Championship, we get the champion CM Punk. He's going to be taking on the WWE Tag Team Champions, but they're going to be complete competing singly in yeah. this match. We get the, the Miz and versus John Morrison. Yes, this was a pretty good opening match. Actually, I really enjoyed this uh, triple threat match between CM Punk versus The Miz versus John Morrison. It was actually pretty good. It was pretty good. Uh, pretty good start off for this match. Uh, Punk attempts the GTS on Morrison. Uh, Morrison grabs the rope, so pretty much uh, CM Punk just jumps, yep. dumps him out on onto the, the apron. apron. Uh, and uh, here comes the Miz out of nowhere, and CM Punk moves out of the way. And, and the Miz hits John Morrison. Morrison takes a big old bump to the floor. CM Punk hits go to sleep on the Miz. One, two, three. CM Punk retains the ECW Championship. Uh, really good match. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, it was a really good match. Uh, so there we go. And now we got a ten women tag team match um, you know not a uh, not a traditional survivor nope. series so uh, first first pinfall wins yep we get the WWE women's champion Beth Phoenix she's gonna be teaming with Layla Julian Hall Victoria and Melina now when Melina comes out Tommy what happens well she she's going she for the slips split. She slips when she was doing the splits on the apron there. She slips off the fucking apron and falls. And uh, she does it again. And then she gets it correct that time. Yeah. She's... And the crowd cheers. <laughs> the crowd cheers because she had to fucking redo her entrance. Uh, they're going to be taking on Tori Wilson, Maria, Kelly Kelly, Michelle McCool, and Mickey James. Oh, God. Oh, uh, Mickey James has got the shaft on her teammates. Yeah, she did. Uh, so, so, so let's go ahead and say this. Beth Phoenix is a worker on her team. Victoria is a worker on her team. Melina. Uh, Melina is, is a decent worker, and so is Julian Hall. Layla just sucks. Yeah. Um, on the other team... You just got Mickey James. <laughs> you just got Mickey James, because Tori Wilson, yes, yeah, she's been there a long time, but she's not that much of a worker. Maria, she's... she's never claimed to be a wrestler. Yeah. Uh, Kelly, Kelly, Kelly Kelly don't know how to wrestle. <laughs> And Michelle McCool, this was before Michelle she got McCool, it. This was before, and by the way, she was wearing a Dwayne Wade jersey trying to get a smattering of claps. <laughs> yeah, down there in the Miami yeah. heat area. Yeah, I should know. Uh, but uh, Michelle McCool didn't peak at this time either. No. Uh, so she wasn't a top star. So, uh, yeah, so overall you get got pretty, uh, like, uh, like a, you got the, the, the four versus the one here. Yeah. <laughs> no doubt. Uh, pretty much, uh, Beth Phoenix grabs, um, was it Mickey James? Yeah. And, uh, Tori Wilson and Maria go in there, knock Beth Phoenix off, and then they no, get... No, it's Kelly Kelly. Well, uh, whatever. It Sa don't fucking matter. Same difference. No, no, yeah. no fucking real workers Yeah, it really match. don't fucking matter. But nonetheless, we get a big schmoz on the outside. Yeah. Uh, that's what I'm trying to get to, the big schmoz on the yeah, outside. Yeah, big schmoz. Um. And Melina and Mickey James, the only two in the ring. So, Melina attempts the neck breaker. 
uh, Mickey kind of counteracts it, grab her by her hair, and kisses her. Yeah, that was the only enjoyment I got of that match. Yeah, uh, which we know Jerry Lawler was wetting his yeah. fucking uh, yeah. pants there for that. And uh, <laughs> she ends up doing a spinning back kick. Yep. Melina does a flip. <laughs> One, two, three. One, Mickey two, three. James beats Melina. So Mickey James' team wins the uh, 10 Diva Tag Team match. Uh, <clears throat> not that great of a match. Yeah, not that good of a match. It was shitty. Yeah. Uh, but here we go. We get a World Tag Team Championship match with the champions Lance Cade and Trevor Murdoch. They're going to be taking on uh, a team that beat uh, Paul London and Brian Kendrick and the Highlanders on... on on internet heat. On internet heat on WWE.com. Yeah. So the winners of that was going to get a title shot at Survivor Series. And it and it was Hardcore Holly and Cody Rhodes. Hardcore Holly and Cody Rhodes. Um, this match was just okay. It was okay. It, it didn't set the world no, on fire. No, it didn't set the world on fire. Uh, Hardcore Holly goes for a clothesline on Cade, and they both go over the rope. Yep. Uh, Cody attempts the DDT on Murdoch, but Murdoch reverses it in two. The Ace of Spades. The Ace of Spades was like a, which is like a, a fl sunset flip, like pin. A, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sunset flip pin, uh, pins down Cody's shoulders. One, two, three. Lance and, Cade, uh, Trevor Murdoch yep, prevail. Lance Cade and Trevor Murdoch retain the World Tag Team Titles. Uh, Holly ends up picking up Cody, and uh, just says good job. Yeah, yeah, good job. Leaves, and the Sla crowd boos. <laughs> slaps him on the arm, you know, with a good job. And the crowd boos. <laughs> and the crowd boos. Like they do with any other yeah. hard, a hardcore Holly match. Yeah, of course. Uh, which I, I like hardcore Holly. Yeah, I myself, like hardcore Holly too. <clears throat> Here we go. We get a traditional Survivor Series match. Finally. Finally. We get the team of Mr. Kennedy, Finley, one of your favorites, Big Daddy V with Matt Stryker, mm -hmm. MVP, and Umaga. They're going to be taking on a lopsided team because yeah. Matt Hardy was supposed to be involved in this match, but MVP attacked him, uh, injured him, injured him because he grabbed he grabbed his. Uh, what are you doing over there, pops? <laughs> but anyway, uh, he grabs. Uh, I'm uh, uh, I'm unwrapping this big package I got. Nonetheless, he uh, he grabs uh, Matt Hardy, slams his knee on on the steel steps. Yeah. Matt Hardy's is out. Uh, so we get a lopsided team. It's a five on four. We get Kane, Rey Mysterio, Jeff Hardy, and Triple H. Yes. Uh, first one eliminated, Tommy? Kane. Kane. Uh, we get a Samoan drop and an elbow drop by Big Daddy V. Yeah, Big Daddy V eliminates Kane. And then, right off the bat, here comes a fucking another fucking elimination on that team. Yep. With fucking uh, Rey, Rey Mysterio. Mysterio. Uh, we see pretty much a, they say it was a, it was like a, a side slam, but it looked like a gun sling yeah. on my ass, uh, from Umaga. Umaga does a, uh, Samoan gun spike. Yeah, gunslinger, Samoan spike on him, and that, down goes Ray. Yep. That eliminates Ray Mysterio. <clears throat> so now it's fucking, it, it's five on two, so Jeff Hardy and Triple H, and I was like, Tommy, if anybody can fucking, fucking come back from it, it's gonna be Triple H, and I fucking. Well, fuck, if it's five <laughs> on one, Triple H can count that. <laughs> five. Well, fuck. Well, Jeff Hardy's no help anyway. Ain't that right? Ain't, ain't that right, Nick Kurtz? <laughs> and Charles. <laughs> and Charles. Jeff Hardy sucks. First one eliminated on the other side team is MVP with the twist of fate by Jeff Hardy. Yep. Then we see Mr. Kennedy who, uh, well, he gets a spine buster for his trouble. Yeah, then Triple H was about to pin him. Here comes Big Daddy V. He accidentally elbows fucking Kennedy because Triple H moved out of the way. And that eliminates Mr. Kennedy. Oh, and I forgot to say during Mr. Kennedy's entrance, he was talking on the mic, but it sounded like he was fucking talking in a fucking coffee can. Yeah. Because <laughs> until they fixed his mic. But, uh, so yeah, Big Daddy V fucking drops an elbow drop on him on accident, and down goes Kennedy. He's out. Uh, next one to take the fall, Big, Big Daddy, Daddy v. v. With a, uh, double DDT from both Jeff Hardy and Triple H. And that eliminates Big Daddy V. And then... Last of the Mohegans for uh, for that team. Come on, is, is it going to be Umaga? Is it going to be Finley? It's going to be Finley. Yeah. Uh, so Finley gets gets taken yep, out. Yep. Yep. Finley got his pedigree checked. <laughs> I knew you were going to say it. And then that was the end of uh, that was the end of Finley there. The Irishman. So now it's down to a two on one. Jeff Hardy and Triple H versus Umaga. Yep. And I'm pretty sure you guys. Yeah, Umaga goes for the ass bump. 
Triple H moves out of the way. Kicks him. Triple uh, Umaga try to clothesline. Triple H kicks him in the gut. The Samoan Bulldozer Umaga got his pedigree checked. Knew it. Jeff Hardy hits the Swanton. One, two, three. Umaga's eliminated. So your sole survivors are Jeff Hardy and Triple H. Jeff Hardy and Triple H. Now we get into one of Tommy's favorites here, and I'm not jumping the gun on this one. Shane McMahon comes out. That was the only enjoyment I saw. <laughs> he introduces his his daddy. Oh yeah, here Vince comes Vince. Big. <laughs> doing the doing the Vince walk. <laughs> here comes Vince. Here comes walking down. And he introduces his half little brother, Hornswoggle McMahon. <laughs> <Got it. laughs> I see your face already. Uh, now we get the fucking Kylie fucking brings his fucking big tree trunk. No, 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 no. no. Uh, here comes Rudgett Singh and and the chisel chin fuck. <laughs> the great Kylie with three bullets on his chest. Here he comes out in his fucking black sweatpants. Here he comes out. <laughs> do, do the fucking walk. <laughs> yes. Uh, and pretty much, Runchin Sin explains the rules. Oh, yeah. Can I, can I do Runchin Sin's expression for the rules here? Yeah. I want you to be the referee here. No gouging of the yeah, eyes. Yeshi. <laughs> what was the other one? No pulling the hair. Ayeshi. <laughs> All that dumb shit. Nobody. Uh, yang, 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 yang. <laughs> yeah, yeah, nobody. Yang, 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 yang. Uh, I was like, what the fuck is this? Yeah, what the fuck is this? And Tommy, when 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 uh when Hornswoggle and the Great Collie were standing together, what was the crowd chanting? Shaq. We, we want Shaq. We want Shaq. And I would too. Shaquille O'Neal was sitting in his white shirt. In his white shirt with the Shaq logo right <laughs> yeah. there. And the crowd was chanting, we want Shaq. While this fucking shitty match was going on. Be honest, I'd rather see Shaq make three throws than this fucking match. Because this match sucks. This but match nonetheless. sucks. And Shaq's just sitting there and Vince goes, goes, I don't give better, a damn what you want. <laughs> you better not get involved. I don't give a damn what you guys want. Yeah. <laughs> so, we get Hornswoggle McMahon. Oh, yeah. He's going to be taking on the great Colleen. Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Here we go. <laughs> and you know it's serious when Hornswoggle takes off that fucking poopy poopy green shirt. <laughs> the that, jacket. That, that baby's shit diarrhea in the, in the screen. Uh, he, ta yeah. he takes off the hat. He throws yeah. it at him. I'm surprised he didn't take off the fucking nurse pants he was wearing. <laughs> so he, yeah. he starts, starts taking off his then clothes. Then he fucking does. He fucking goes after Runjit Singh here. Does the drop, drop kick. kicks on and him. And fucking Shane. Yeah, he's the only one cheering because no one gives a fuck. <laughs> yeah, no one else cares. Oh, let me try to get this over. Yay! Uh, so pretty much, uh, uh, Runjit Singh gets back up. Fucking Horse yeah, Hornswoggle does the fucking mist on fucking Runjit Singh. Does a fucking jump on him and and fucking then here comes fucking. Fucking chisel chin, fuck Kali, gingerly getting over the fucking rope. Looking underneath the ring. Looking under the on the ring. Can I get my big ass in here? <laughs> Can I get my big fucking tree trunk? Can I ass get my big there? tree trunk fucking height ass in here? Fuck no, fucking let him stay under there. So Hornswoggle comes out yeah, with the other side. Yeah, comes out on the other side. He's got a big ass fucking shillelagh. He's like, come on, come on. He's like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> That's what it was. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And what then fucking, <laughs> fucking Kali grabs the fucking. Shalay just throws that motherfucker. And probably the greatest move I've ever seen in my life. Kali slaps fucking porn swaggle. Right in the back of the head. Yeah. And then you see Shane get up. Yeah. Like he's going to do something. Vince goes, sit the fuck down. Yeah, Vince <laughs> goes, sit the fuck down. Fuck this cluster fuck. <laughs> That's right. Shane gets up and acts like he's going to do something to help his half brother. Yeah, fuck, yeah, fuck it, Vince. Fuck it, he's not ours anyway. Yeah, fuck he's it. a little bastard. He's fuck a, it. He's a little bastard. Uh, so there's fucking there's fucking uh, Hornswoggle laid out on the fucking mat. Yeah. Kylie's about to go get him with the vice grip. <laughs> no, that's something I would have enjoyed. <laughs> Kylie like with, with, yeah. with, 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 with the vice. Right yeah, with the right steer, but yeah, and I and I want him to spit out green. <laughs> well, it was already out. Well, there you go. Well, still, I want and, I want him to squeeze him so hard green comes out. Of and what happens? Let him be like a fucking gusher. <laughs> and what happens? Here comes Finley, and that's Finley. probably the most enjoyment I've ever seen. He 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 finally checked out from his pedigree. Yeah, yeah, he got out. His, he checked off his pedigree here, <laughs> and he comes out. He comes out, fucking hits Great Kali with a shillelagh, gets him in a ball, hits hits fucking Kali in the balls, and, and then fucking takes Hornswoggle with him. Told him to leave. Yeah. So and then and, and then, then he grabs, runs, and sings like, "Come here, motherfucker!" and just throws him away. <laughs> yeah. 
And uh, pretty much after that, Vince and Shane just walk away. Yeah, just walk that fucking here. shit. Yeah, that's the end of that motherfucker. So, the great Kali wins by disqualification because of Finlay. And the match sucks. And the match was fucking stupid as shit. But here we go. WWE Championship match. Oh, no, this match. I love this match. Uh, WWE Championship match. We get Randy Orton, the champion. He's going to be taking on Shawn Michaels. <clears throat> now, Tommy, there was a rule involved in uh, this. Oh, before we get get to the uh, rules of this in match up here. Yeah. My favorite, Vince. They show the highlight video here. You want, you deserve a rematch. What makes you think you deserve a rematch? Huh? Huh? You know, Sean, there's one thing you want. Revenge. Just a you, minute. Just a minute, Sean. You want revenge. You want to put him out. I admit it. I want to hurt him. <laughs> I want to hurt him. <laughs> and then... I want to put him out of his misery. Just like he did me. You know You know what keeps me going is the tears from my wife's eyes when Orton punted me in the head. And then, and then, and then here comes Orton, you know, on the, on the little video package. And he goes, he goes, is it, your wife's <laughs> going to see the same thing in Survivor Series. <laughs> your wife is going to see the same thing after Survivor Series. Uh, uh, honestly, this is a very underrated feud. An underrated feud in 07, Sean and Orton. Pre, uh, great yeah. matches, pretty decent feud. Uh, I enjoyed it myself. But the rules of this match is if Shawn Michaels uses the super kick. He will no longer get any WWE Championship matches. Yeah, and he'll be automatically disqualified. And he's automatically disqualified. So the super kick to Sweet Chin Music is banned. And if Randy Orton gets disqualified, Shawn Michaels wins the WWE Championship. So if, if Orton gets disqualified, he will lose his WWE Championship. Uh, now during this match, Shawn is playing mind games, some psychic games out, psyching him yeah. out with the super kick. Yeah. Acting like he's about to do it. And Orton's putting up the hands because he doesn't want he does he doesn't want to take it because every, every time he took it he went down like yeah. a limp noodle. Yeah. Cause cause he <laughs> Sean super kicked him what five or six times. Yeah. Uh and every time fucking Orton falls like a limp noodle. That's great. Uh Orton uh, kicks Michaels off of him, uh, and uh, Michaels hits his head on the ring post. Yep. Orton. Yeah, Randy uh, Orton goes for the RKO. Shawn Michaels shoves, shoves him, him away. Fucking Randy Orton almost got body slammed. Orton counters it. Shawn Michaels is about to do the super kick. Has, but he has, yeah, but he, he has hesitated. Him. Randy Orton's like, fuck you, RKO. Yes. One, two, three. And Shawn Michaels. Shawn Michaels. Goes down at the hands of Randy Orton. And so Randy Orton retains the WWE Championship. And to, and to me, I thought... And you want to tell you what my favorite was? Sean just laid there. <laughs> he didn't just lay there. <laughs> but, uh, but he sold that... Hey, but he took a good RK over there, though. What, uh, what a story told in this match, Yeah, in my opinion. Sean hesitated because he knew if, if he if he landed the super kick... He disqualified. He disqualified. Orton took advantage of the RKO... Of course, there's Sean because Sean never won the WWE Championship ever after after fucking 2002. So I knew Sean wasn't gonna fucking win. <laughs> of course not. Uh, and uh, pretty much Orton wins the match. He picks up Sean, yeah. shoves him in the corner, he shoves him, in the starts corner. slapping him. I beat you, Sean. I beat I'm you. the best. Say it. I'm the best. Say it. I'm the best. I beat you. I beat you. And then, and then fucking Randy Orton grabs the belt. Sweet chin music by Shawn Michaels. Orton goes down. <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> he, he fucking he has this blank look on his face after the super kick. So he falls like a let. <laughs> pretty much that's the face. He falls down like a let limp noodle again. Yep. With the fucking and then face. Shawn Michaels says, "Go to hell." Yeah, yeah he, he falls next to him. And he goes, "Go to hell." And then Shawn walks off, pulling up the bloomers, pulling up the bloomers. Praise to God. Yep. And pretty much that's the end of that. Yeah, I mean, or love and the Orton match. finally gets up, and they say still WWE Champion Randy Orton, he raises the belt. Booze. Yeah, booze. <laughs> There's some booze in there. Uh, so Randy Orton is still the WWE Champion. Now, Tommy, we get a little video package that we've seen for a few months now on these WWE pay-per-views, but we never addressed it till now. There's been these this this code going on, and, and it would say Second Coming, and and save us, yeah. and all these different letters and numbers and, and everything, and um, it, it does a countdown that will end the next night on Raw. Yeah. It said 23 hours and 
like 32 minutes or some yeah. shit. And it's going to end on Raw, which we're going to get into that yeah. here, in, here in a little bit. And then we get the main event of WWE Survivor Series 2007. We get a Hell in a Cell match for the World Heavyweight Championship. When Charles Reed Fowler's boy, <laughs> the reigning and defending World Heavyweight Champion, Batista, Batista Man, takes on The Undertaker. Big Bad Booger Red. That's right. And, and of course, you know Undertaker means business. Oh, yeah. You, Undertaker is already coming out here because Batista's already in the ring. Not coughing, of course. <laughs> Yeah. Here he comes. With his eyes bugged yeah. out. <laughs> fucking Undertaker grabs the fucking cell, closes it really hard. You know you fucked up when you know you <laughs> see the cell close. Yes. And Batista, look on his face, you knew he fucked up. But the thing is, I think Undertaker fucked up the cell there. Yeah, he he, he pulled it in too hard because you, cause you seen, uh, who was it? Uh, was, was it, uh, it wasn't Mike Keogh. No, it was, it was Jimmy Corderas. Yeah, Jimmy Corderas, he's pulled the cell door yeah. back. Cause he, cause like he he pulled it in and it like and it like came in the cell. But um, Undertaker slams a chair on uh, Batista's throat yep. uh, by by putting it right here and slamming down Batista on yep. the chair. Uh, Batista sitting there, <coughs> yeah, coughing up blood, coughing up blood with his fucking fake ass fucking acting skills. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he he's choking Charles. You want to tell you why he was choking? He was choking because he didn't have a good wrestling career. <laughs> He didn't have a good acting career. MMA career? He didn't have a good MMA career. That's why he was choking. Because Batista always chokes. Yeah, ain't that right, Charles? And, of course, Undertaker lifts him up, rams, him, rams Batista in the cell. He gets the gig. Yeah. <laughs> he starts bleeding. Batista bleeding. Taker gets bloody by uh, by the still steps because yeah. Batista hits him with the still steps. Uh, Batista puts Undertaker through the table with a Batista bomb. Later on, Taker counters that with a tombstone on the steel steps yep. right there in the middle of the ring. And and Undertaker goes for the cover, one, two, and the referee gets pulled out. Yep. We didn't know who the fuck yeah. pulled out the fucking referee. Somebody yeah. pulled out the referee. Some, and then we see a guy with long hair. You, yeah. still, you still couldn't see who the fuck it was. Yes. And then here comes Edge. Here comes Edge. Here he comes. He's dressed as a cameraman. Yeah, he's dressed as a cameraman. Here comes his Survivor Series shirt. <laughs> with the he camera. He comes in. Hits Undertaker in the head with the camera. D uh, lays Undertaker's head on the still steps. And grabs a chair. Concerto. Concerto on the Undertaker. Grabs Batista. Is like, I know I can beat this motherfucker. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let's put him on top of the Undertaker. One, two, three. And Batista retains the world heavyweight and you title. See, and you see JBL and Michael Cole talking like, about... Why, why did he help Batista? You know why he helped Batista? Because he knows he can beat him. Yeah. How many times did he beat him? Come on! Who would you rather fucking face, Batista or Undertaker? Yeah, come, come on. on. Edge is beating Batista so many times, it's ridiculous. Yeah. Ain't, ain't that right, Charles? <laughs> Last chance, my ass. Last chance. Last chance, my ass, huh, Charles? <laughs> so, no wonder he fucking let Batista win the match. Damn right! I want the weakest guy, too! That's right. Taker starts getting back. He see, he starts getting his getting his uh, his head back yep. in. Uh, he, fucking, start, he starts lifting and up. Fucking Edge comes back, hits him in the head with the chair, <laughs> and then he leaves. Now the Undertaker ain't getting up no more. That's right. And then fade to black WWE logo, and that's the end of Survivor Series 2007. I loved it. Yeah, Which makes sense for Edge yeah. to be on the cover. Yeah. Unlike, unlike fucking Candice Michelle yeah, on Cyber Michelle Sunday. Yeah, Cyber Sunday. At first we were like, why the fuck is Edge on the cover? <laughs> so, because uh, I've never watched this pay-per-view in its entirety till now. So, uh, I really enjoyed it. The matches you could probably bypass. The ten women tag. Um, the... Blue K uh, versus Great Collie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those two you could pass for sure. Um... Kate and Murdoch and and Holly and Rhodes was okay. Yeah, it was just but the okay. rest the rest of the card stacked. Yeah, no doubt about it. Um, and then we get the extras, which is on Raw. We finally get to you only see get the, one extra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we only get one extra, which is finally that debut countdown. Yep. Of the second coming, save us. Yeah, Randy Orton's cutting a promo saying, "I want the torch to be passed." Here comes some schmuck that's been running. Got fucking water all over him. It ain't sweat. Yeah. He's got water all he's, over him. He's carrying the torch. <laughs> We're making this face while he's running. Yeah. And then out of nowhere, somebody clotheslines yeah, him. Yeah, someone clotheslines him. 
And it's and then you see this as a well, that's a dead giveaway. <laughs> yeah, that's a dead giveaway on who that is. And then, and then the internet ruined it. <laughs> yeah, the internet ruined it too. Yeah. If you guys remember 2007, everybody was saying it was Jericho. Yeah. Nobody knew for sure till then, but uh, there, there was that rumor saying it was Jericho, and it was uh, because you seen the second coming. Uh, you seen the, the countdown to it. Second coming. It said save us, and it said two two two, but it went to Y two. J yeah, and there's and then, Jericho doing yep, the pose. There's Jericho comes out, cuts a great promo. Yep, uh, on, on Randy and Orton. And fucking Randy Orton goes, "Who the hell are you saving us from?" Yeah, I'm saving, I'm saving, <laughs> I'm saving all of us from you, Orton. Yeah, <laughs> uh, which leads into, uh, if you guys remember, later on, uh, uh, Jericho wants to campaign to try to yep. get a WWE Championship match. So. There you guys go. That's the end of WWE Survivor Series 2007. Overall, I really enjoyed the pay-per-view, no doubt. Yeah, this was uh, a really good pay-per-view. If you guys enjoyed this review, hit that thumbs up button. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash WrestleRampage2. Follow us on Twitter at WrestleRampage. If you guys want to send something for Mailbag Monday, you guys can. Anytime you guys want to, Joseph Flat, F-L-A-T-T at P.O. Box 6005, Elizabeth Town, Kentucky. 42702 and don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more great videos right here from one of the best damn wrestling YouTube channels go today Wrestling Rampage Tommy take it away if you don't subscribe right here to Wrestling Rampage then I guess you just don't know wrestling